How's it going guys? Welcome back to probably one of the craziest progress videos for our hardcore group admin team ever so far. The entire episode is just jam-packed with so much progression for our team from some skilling goals to massive PVM goals. You do not want to skip any of it. Anyways, if you enjoyed today's video, definitely please leave a like. That would help a lot. And consider subscribing so you don't miss out on future content for this hardcore admin team and other big updates like next and leaks. All right, enjoy today's video. As for group activities, we're doing a lot of chambers and demonic gorillas. And Fuse is doing a lot of crafting grinds for our Zenites. There it is, 600 KC. 600, 600. I'm just trying to get some items for the boys. We have three blowpipes so far and uh, 600 kills. I haven't gotten an item in like 350 kills now. Alright, just made a bunch of adamant darts. So we can now use it at Zora again. And at Demonics. What the f- Are you serious? A dragon spear? I've never gotten one on this account. No, that's the worst time to get a dragon spear. There it is, 800kc. Damn, we're almost four times dry for an item now. Woo! <laughs> hey, this is gonna be a three kill trip. Oh my goodness, Bashy did it. Three kill trip. Yo, hey, let's go. Double teleports. Oh my god, finally. Oh, what? Whoa, I completed a master task <laughs> out of nowhere. Perfect Zora. It, okay, I mean, I didn't, I didn't, I don't remember what that is. Just don't fail any mechanics, I guess. What mechanic didn't I fail? Oh, no. Oh, no, dude. Are you serious, man? Dude, over 500 kills. 550 kills of nothing, dude. And then I get an Onyx. The Onyx is somewhat acceptable because we still need an Onyx for the Zenite for the first anguish, so yay! Oh, there it is, number 1000. We have the pet, three blow pipes, and Onyx. And uh, still missing these two bad boys, so I guess we keep going. Let me ask you guys a very simple question What KC as Zora do you think it will take me to get? A Surp Helm or a Magic Fang, you can name the KCs for both of them. Let me know. I wonder who is the closest. Oh, 91 range. Yo, let's go. Let's go. Black Demons? Hell yeah. Alright, we still want to get the second Zenite because I want that Anguish myself, so... Uh, we Whoa. need that. Yeah, we need that. Yo, we can make a Heavy Ballista almost. <laughs> I need uh, only a tail now. Yeah, just uh, the tail, and we have a heavy ballista though. For sure. Ah, For sure, we needed. <gasps> oh! Yes! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yo, yes! Yo! Yes, finally, man. Oh my god. Let's go, another Zenite. Oh, oh, yes. We are like, dude, Yo, we're holy shit. Oh, Damn, let's go. Alright, first we have to do the- Oh! Oh my god! I got the Dragon Warhammer! Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> what? Let's go! Yes, baby! Team No Dying, first Dragon Warhammer. What KC did I get it on? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Okay. 590, baby. 590. We're feeling brave enough now to go ahead and do other rooms like Fossa, Nestero, and Fespila. For Fossa, I have an Abyssal Dagger that I got from Fuse when he was doing Slayer. From Abyssal Demons, it's going to be really good there. And Mutz also has a Warhammer, which means we will be able to do our chamber so much faster with it. Damn, the Abyssal Dagger is doing work though. So, we only have one Warhammer right now, but we do have separate spec bars so in order to maximize the warhammer at chambers and at other bosses we need to take turns using the warhammer so we use up our spec we can give it to my teammate and then they can spec again so that's what we try to do is try to take turns switching warhammers between each other at like tecton at like all okay trading 
<laughs> yeah, this is so weird. Okay, get ready to trade. Oh, hold on. Nah, too late, too late. Wanna try? Yo, we did it! Eat, eat, don't eat. <laughs> yeah, that was scary, yeah. Yeah, I think we need to make sure we're 4 HP before we make this trade. What? Okay, hold on. I got it, I got it. <laughs> I worked! <laughs> Yo, we did it. I landed, I landed. Okay, that's good enough. Oh, well. Ooh, oh, dragon arrows. Dragon arrows and teak planks. 300. That's actually really good for uh, mahogany homes for me. I would love to use that. There we go. I can light it. We can cook some bats. <laughs> yeah, it might be a twisted leak. When I had to cook hard food to kill Modadao. <laughs> so we can do Fispila as well, but we can't do it the risky way with the redemption method because if you make a mistake, you're instantly dead. We can't afford that, but you can do it the proper way, which isn't too bad. The proper way involves hitting the actual boss to the point where it will go down on the ground and won't sting you. So you have time to safely attack the portal for a few hits. So that's what we do. And... As a bonus, if you do damage to the actual boss, you actually gain points. So you get a decent amount of rage points for doing it. So it's fairly worth it. And it's fairly consistent with what we have right now for gear. Oh my god, the Jibay. Too late, too late. Can't even trade. How many scales? Damn, 137k scales. I'm going to put some of this investment into some anti-venoms. Because it can make our Zora grind just a smidge more comfortable. So I have these extra skills. I think it's, it'll be all right to mix it up between antis and anti-venom. So my plan with the anti-venom is that because it resists venom for a minute and 30 seconds, I can use the dose when the boss starts hitting me with poison for about 12 damage. And that should almost get me all the way to the end of the fight sometimes without getting poison ever. And if I do get poisoned at the end, I could just clear it with two normal anti-poison doses. So it should allow me to conserve a lot more food per kill. So three kill trips will be a lot more consistent and I can maintain my teleports a lot easier that way. Uh, using anti-venom, three doses, one per kill. That works pretty nice. I guess I can do more three kill trips. Oh yeah, that's right. Let me let me bring out the the good old Fury. The emitted of footy? Where is it? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> we got a freaking furry for use. That's nice. More prayer. And a bit more defense, so that's sweet. Definitely nice. We gotta share it though. Only got one Fury for now. Oh, I'm trolling. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh, oh. I'm out. Bro, screw this phase, man. <laughs> Sweet, the ghost finished off the snakeling for me. Lovely. Oh, shit. That was scary. Oh, my God. I just got one HP. Holy shit. Oh my god, I, I just got like 1 HP, dude. What the f- Yikes, dude. Someone clipped that. <laughs> that was crazy. Oh my god. Good thing I was fast on the food, dude. Oh my days, dude. Alrighty, so Fuse is working on Rex for Saldi Elves. And gold ores are going to be really good for him. For Smithing to 70. And we got to do some stuff for Mutz as well. I got a good trade coming up with him. Alright. This is the Super Compat prep going here uh i got a bunch of extra herbs so this is uh oh look at this torn purse bro good yeah. trade ryan good trade good trade <laughs> good trade yeah he's he's the only <laughs> one musk can solo race because he has a semi herb so damn well it's, it's worth it I, i've been wanting torn purse girl for a while we got an extra one finally so <laughs> thank you for the uh trade there boom baby preserve that's really good fuse about to do the salt elf final boss and need some anglers, so we're gonna give him some anglers. 
Yo, my boy. Fuse completed. Saw the else just now. There it is, and no lives have been lost. Feels good, man. <clears throat> Thank you, Kyle. I probably would have died if you didn't do that. Oh, let me grab some brutes. There must be tons. Jeez, that super combat potion grind gave us so many, um, like, brutes. <laughs> Potions in general, but especially the brutes, like... Oh! Paid off! Purple! Yes! Paid off! I chanced this raid, but I didn't get a purple. Oh my god. Let's see it. What's it gonna be? Oh, Dex! Let's go! Let's go! Second Dex for the team. Hell yes! Yes! Nice. Any back to backs? Oh, no way! No way I just got a back to back! No way I just got a back to back! Oh. No way. What is it? Oh, the what? Eldemo! Oh my god! <laughs> Mega rare! Alright! Okay! <laughs> now, this is gonna. Sweet. Alright, shout out to freaking Mutz with his back to back. Dude, his RNG is on fire, dude. It's for real, dude. As long as I keep going dry, I think he's gonna keep getting the drops. <laughs> Which isn't so bad, I guess. Alright, well, we can use that uh, Tekton now. Yeah, bro. Yo, hit me up with the Dex, boss. Hit me up with that Dex. <laughs> I can't even use it yet. Can't use it yet, but I'll, I'll unlock it today, dude, for sure. I'll unlock it today. But yeah, shout out Mr. Mutz, though, for the freaking the freaking uh rigor dude hell yeah we got it but but yeah thank you very much uh dude do we have enough supplies i think i probably do 600 dram bones and like all the insult heads man they wanna they wanna open up a uh an altar for me after the raids maybe if you're wondering why i'm not doing solo raids myself and it's simple it's because in order to do it safely on the hardcore group iron man you need at least seven eight herbler to make the best brews at raids and only one of us can have that because it takes a lot of time to gather the herbs and we funnel all the herbs into mutts for his initial song of the elf grind so it made sense for him to rush the sunday first and all the other higher level potions so yeah he's gonna be the one doing solo raids whenever we can't group up just because of time differences and stuff so it'll be a bit more efficient that way so Mr. Fuse decided to be our main crafter to make Zenites because he just had a hair transplant surgery. So that means he can't do anything like sketchy for a bit as he recovers. So he just decided to do crafting and he used the two Zenites that we had and turned them into anguish. So I have my own anguish now, which is going to be super nice because my blowpipe be a little splashy. And with rigor and anguish, the blowpipe should be so much better now. Yeah, yeah we just got our first level. Oh, 1700 total. Let's go. 1700 total. I think this is one of the best parts about Group Iron Man. You could go so dry, but your teammates can get super lucky or just make gains and yeah, kind of makes up for your dryness. There it is. 74 prayer. Now we have freaking rigor. It's crazy. I mean, I definitely didn't really earn this, but hey, it's freaking nice. I need I need all the uh, boost that I can get at Zora, man. Seriously, dude, trying to speed up these kills. So, oh, okay, they're all melee. Damn, dude, my range setup is definitely a lot better now. Especially on that blue phase, like, damn, look at that! I did like almost two hundred damage on that blue phase. Definitely noticing it. The power ups. Yeah, this blue phase will will be a lot more attractive for me. Middle school me thought it was cute. Bro. Oh no! I can't believe this stupid snake, bro. Come on, man. I'm pissed. I only ah, uh, bro. I only get onyxes, man. 
And it's not like I'm super lucky at Onyx's either, bro. Oof. Alright. No, it's just an Onyx. Different. Ugh. Well, we did make a Fury with one of the Onyxes. Oh, actually, we have this Onyx. It's not useless. Yeah, fortunately, it's not useless. Okay, I think that's the last Onyx we'll ever get. Right, I got three blowpipes with nothing else in between. I got three Onyxes with nothing else in between. That means there is no more Onyxes. Clearly. So the next drop is something else. And then it'll be three of that. Wait, I just level up. Yo, 92 hit points. Let's go. Hell yeah, one more level and I can maximize my angler benefits. Wow, that was such a good spec. Holy crap, did I just hit a 33? That was amazing. I love Rigor, that's for sure. Alright, we really need some prayer potions for Zora. Oh, thank god, 200. Ah, uh, thankfully we invested in the kingdom. Oh, so nice. Yeah, I gotta start farming some Ranars too. Yeah, everybody's like using up prayer potions like mad, so not just me. So that means we have to stock up kind of a bit on our own. Yeah, just using supplies like pretty fast as Zora. But hey, it is what it is when you kill like 50 to 70 of it a day on the hardcore group. So prayer pots gotta be used. So 300 will last a while. It's more like 204 doses, I guess. Let's freaking get it, boys. Whoa, I just got a master clue. Uh huh. I don't think I can do this. Wait. Wait. We can actually do this if I get a if I buy a crystal bow, but that's gonna cost a lot of money. But we're rich. I got like we got like 20 mil in the bank, so uh hmm. Oh, we can do this. We're so lucky, dude. We're actually insanely lucky right now. I do have a lot of experience doing this one, so. No! Ah, god damn it, bro. Wow, we make pretty good progress. Although, I think I, I might take the risk at some point and try to try to go there. You know, try to go to the wild, dude. I'm not doing it right now, dude. Screw that shit. <laughs> But yeah, we'll, you know, we'll plan for it one of these days. We'll plan for it. Ah, uh, time to do these clue scrolls in the wilderness. <laughs> They're both in the same area. All around here, so. Also gonna unlock the music track for Scorpio for the hard clue. Might as well. This guy has no defense. Alright. Okay, okay, it's done. Sweet, alright. <laughs> oh, we always want to pray mage, by the way. Ah, uh, true, 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 true. Oh my god, will this volcano? Oh, really? Shit. Oh, okay. well, yeah. Do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Might as well. Might as well. Sweet. Alright, music track done. Alright, miss. Oh, it's a dig step, isn't it? Okay. Oh. These can hit very hard. Yeah, yeah, they, they freaking do be hitting really hard. Oh, I still need to pray melee. Okay. Oh, dragon pickaxe? Oh my god. No, <laughs> I'll just hold on to it. Uh, Might get yeah, it one I day. I'll I mean, it's, it's it five soon. steps. This, this is like the fifth step, so. Here's some miscellaneous level ups I got while AFK Slayer in between my actual grinds. Yo, first ever cross task, trying to get a black demon test for the good old demonics. And I got a leap battle axe. Next time I get these guys, I can melee them, I guess. All right, here we go. 89 magic. This is a really big level here. Just because of the magic divine potions. So magic divine potions give me plus four magic, right? Plus one will get me to 90, which is a new max with the trident. Plus three, that gets me 93. That's another max hit. So this is a huge deal for me. Like two max hits Azora. 92 range.